Kale Berger with you from Pittsburgh Sports now here on the south side for day five of pit training camp and it was the first day of full pads practice and gave us an opportunity to see a little more about this pit team what to expect and the first thing we got a better look at Mark Whipple's new offense more specifically the passing game I saw a little seven on seven drill today with the first team offense first team defense got an idea of who those uh, the starting defense might be uh, come August 31st against Virginia uh, that'll be in sights and sounds on pittsburghsportsnow.com but looking at what the offense did today the offense uh it took a little bit for them to get things going um the defense was flying around the defense looked athletic especially the secondary they did a nice job today uh after the, the offense had some incompletions to start, Kenny Pickett was able to throw two touchdown passes. The first one, I believe, was to Taysier Mack on a corner route. The second one came on a back shoulder fade, a beautifully thrown ball, and a really nicely run route by Aaron Matthews uh, on the left side of the field. So uh, they were able to uh, get that uh, get two touchdowns there uh, in the 7-on-7 seven seven part of practice. Uh, Pickett also almost threw two interceptions. Uh, one of them was on a corner route again. The uh, defensive back dropped it out of bounds. And the second one was uh, trying to force a pass inside to Will Gregg, the senior tight end uh, that was nearly uh, picked off and taken back uh, by senior safety, Damar Hamlin. Uh, other things today, we got another look at the offensive line. They got to go live against the defensive line. And the biggest takeaway for the offensive line is this. They're trying to replace four starters uh, from last year's team. The only returning starter is center Jimmy Morrissey. So today was a big day for the offensive line to figure some things out, to get some live action against the defensive line. And we spoke to Pitt assistant head coach and defensive line coach Charlie Partridge today, and he was ecstatic he was very happy with the way the defensive line has performed so far in camp uh was impressed with their showing today against the offensive line and talked about a lot of those different guys um that have really made their mark and shown out here he also talked about uh junior defensive end rashad weaver and his aspirations to be acc defensive player of the year his thoughts on that and the way he prepares and why he thinks that that's uh, he likes that his players have those individual goals so a lot of action today from day five of Pitt training camp. It was the first day of pads, so make sure you check out pittsburghsportsnow.com for my stories from today's practice. Check out Pittsburgh Sports Live for all the interviews with coaches and players. And as always, make sure to subscribe. It helps us out a lot here at Pittsburgh Sports Now. But until next time, I'm Kale Berger, Pittsburgh Sports Now.